outside. Ready? Yep. <laughs> what do you think, Marilyn? Is this your favorite time in the barn all by yourself? I love that um, no eggies in the barn, just the two golf balls. But they were definitely in and out checking them. Um, I'm going to move my camera because it's right there. And I can't really see, so I'm going to mount it like right here so then I can see both sides. Feels like fall out here today, but this is where he's at. The farm gate. And you want to tell the people why you're digging it by hand instead of getting. Because they don't have. Because I don't have one for the tractor. I could have rented one, but then I have to time it with the availability of the rental, and I didn't plan ahead. <laughs> So that is why he's digging by hand. So no eggies this morning, but one of the hens was just singing and I read online that um, that that's the egg song. So maybe we'll get some more eggs today. Um, I have to flip the Airbnb in a little bit, in about 45 minutes. So I'm gonna help Chris with his fence. He's coming along. Oh, Belly, you think you're coming all the way down here? You're not. I'll hook you up. Um, anyways, Chris's gate's coming along and he just needs help with it a little bit. So I'm gonna help him before I have to go down and flip. This is why Belly is getting a fence. She wouldn't run away, she would wander away. She was over here, then she just went up in there, got tangled around that tree, and then just beelined it for down there. She just a wanderer, smelling all the smells. Got done flipping. It's always fun to look at this, isn't it? <laughs> but Chris was, Chris and I always look on the Facebook marketplace for like random stuff. You never know what you need. And we saw this guy selling these awesome benches for like super cheap. And so we went and got one and it looks perfect there. It's a little low for me, <laughs> but it'll be great for like kids instead of sitting up on those logs. And then we you move those two chairs that used to be up on the deck because a lot of people are using this campfire area, which is awesome. And then our next project that we're gonna look at is getting a new picnic table because that one's very wonky, but solid bench and um, we actually bought another one for our house so I'll show you that when I go back we found these in the marketplace and this guy made them himself this one's super sturdy he put polyurethane over it so it'll last I can't remember the kind of wood it is but that's I think it was an, an eight foot bench I think it's super sweet it smells really good too I can smell it right now but that will be our little campfire ring that we'll eventually make, but here's Chris's all his landscaping ties. It's coming along. Singing today, but no more eggies. You singing, Tita? So they're definitely using 
their nesting boxes to go in. Um, you can see like they've kind of made little spots, but no eggs are in there. Do we need to go outside? It's been raining this morning, so everyone's been cooped up, but I'll go let them out now. This is a squawking chicken. You gonna give me an eggy? She's like out here screaming her little egg song that I didn't we don't have anymore since the other day. You have something to tell everybody? Good girl. Was that hard work? Pretty. It's still a little tiny. So fun. There's another one out here screaming. And I guess that's, you can hear her in there. <laughs> Success! My golf balls are working because this is the biggest egg we've found so far. Just came in here to put them all to bed and somebody else laid an egg. Gosh, she's so pretty. Okay, good night everybody. We're making our farm fresh eggs for the first time. Uh, the big egg that came from the chicken yesterday I just cracked it and it gave me two yolks, so I cook fry this up and give it a try. Belly, are you being super wubby? Standing up, giving hugs and kisses. No, you want to play now. I have rock. I don't know if you guys can see this, but I think they're ready to come out. All four of them were in the window. Is it time to come out? I got corn for Chris and I, and it's like a twofer. I've never seen that before. So we got two yolks in the eggy this morning and two on the corn. Belle, you think this is for you? It's for the chickens. Finnick, what do you say? I know I don't have a lot of corn, sorry guys. see this but there's a broken egg in there and we can't decide if the 
chicken ate it or this golf ball was out here and Chris threw it back in so he doesn't know if he broke it but there's no egg eggshell and earlier today I noticed I don't know where she's at but one of the chickens had like white all or yellow all over her so then I thought that it was an egg but so we had an egg today we just didn't keep an egg today last two eggies they're really the small ones Saving the shells for the chickens to eat for calcium. Oh, the little baby one. <laughs> not, <laughs> not like the mostly yolk. <laughs> and not farm fresh bacon. And ruckus out here. Huh, oh, Belly? What's that noise? So there's. Oh, that's Finnick making that noise. He mimics the hens. That's funny. Why are you mimicking the hens? But there are two hens in the coop right now. So hopefully we'll get some more eggies. So I think we said yesterday that we think that what happened is that Chris, he saw the golf ball um, on the floor and he just like threw it back into the nesting box and he thinks that he broke an egg. And that's why the hen was covered in eggs yesterday and why there was yolk everywhere so hopefully I'll catch it enough today so that to make sure that they're not breaking them and sometimes they break their own eggs you following me um, they break the eggs for the calcium so are you getting ready to lay an eggy for me Open up the window. One, two, three, four, five. Oh Definitely word. five in there. And Six and then seven. <laughs> I just came into the barn. I hope I didn't just step on one. Look at these. So cute. They're definitely getting the hang. My wife's over there, though. Belly like zucchini now. Yeah, cooked. I cooked it, and it's a little bit too tough. So I we were, gave it down for the chickens, and she decided that she wanted it. Which is funny, because she's so picky. Is that good, Belly? our chicken zucchini is that they help themselves in the garden so they're gonna get that one but i just found this other big one today and i just got back from work so it's time to let everybody out is it time to come outside <laughs> yeah it's time to come outside we'll go in and see if there's any eggs it's exciting today because my friends from college have been friends with them for about 15 years now which is crazy um, and apparently we moved back into college today, 13 years ago to start our senior year, but they're coming up for a girls weekend and we blocked out the Airbnb. So we're going to stay down there, but we'll go and see if we have any eggies. We got three last night. So it seems like they're on a night routine and not a day routine yet, but let's see what we have. Golf balls, two golf balls, another golf ball. So no eggs, but we'll check back later this afternoon. Happy Saturday. It is a beautiful, peaceful morning. Here on the farm. Billy and I have been enjoying the last about 30 minutes out here together. I uh, just had a coffee and sitting out here with her.
Donald. <laughs> there is none. That's why the yard is so dry. <laughs> it's over here. Come on. Cheer, 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 cheer. Should you eat some belly? Support. We're over at my dad's house, so going through in his garden. He said, "Leave a pretty." Yeah, I would go probably up higher. Well, then I have to cut numerous. Oh. Yeah. I think I need to cut like right. Yeah, I guess. So this is a pumpkin on his vine that we're gonna harvest. Don't drop it on the ground and break oh, it. Wow, that thing is massive. There and he's go. going in for the second one. Oh, this one I can totally leave. Oh, big step. And the girls are having a field day. They love it. Oh. All nice. Things. I wonder oh yeah, he the tri-colored. He did those. Oh, cool. Um, I wonder if they had different colors. Um, how'd you find that big one? You know, I would just go down to the stock and find the beefiest one. Yeah. Oh yeah. And one of those cabbages if they're ready. Oh yeah, they're ready. <laughs> so cool. Is my dad's got one, two, three, four, five Are eggs. Good? They're like the little sizes. Oh, and that's the top of the carrot. Wanted to open up the big barn door. So we did. We came up into our barn and the mice have made a nest with the chicken feathers. An absolutely gorgeous evening for a campfire. And we are going to cook, um, some people call them hobo dinner, some people, people call them foil packets. Um, getting the fire going so that we can cook dinner on the fire tonight. So you take tin foil and we're going to put in um, ground beef and potatoes and onions and carrots and some other veggies if you want to. And you put them in the fire and you cook them for 10 to 15 minutes and you... Pull them out, and that's your meal. So it's just an absolutely awesome night tonight. Little breeze keeps the bugs away.
tractor from down in the cabin of the caboose and I heard something in the woods. These guys made their way all the way down here. Come on, chick, 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 chick. So my friends just left and I was checking the barn cam and I sent Chris out. What did you find in the barn? Three eggs, but one's got a little crack in the end. I don't know if it got pecked at. Oh, I don't know. I'll look at it. But that makes six eggies for today. So that's great.